Here was a man who developed a cult-like following over the years, despite the fact that nobody really knew anything about the guy at all. Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're looking at the most mysterious people of all time. Many of the papers relating to the Jack the Ripper investigation have either been destroyed or else have disappeared from the official files, and without them, it is impossible to establish the guilt of one particular suspect. For this list, we're going over the famous or obscure public figures about whom surprisingly little is known. If there's a person you're mystified didn't make our list, give us a clue down in the comments. The Babushka Lady Few events have as much speculation or mystery around them as the assassination of U.S. President John F. Kennedy. In a warehouse, a sniper with a rifle poised waits. Some of those theories revolve around the bystanders. One of these is the so-called babushka lady, a woman wearing a headscarf like the babushka commonly worn by elderly Russian women. She was filmed and photographed holding a camera. The babushka lady was present in almost all of the photos and videos of the moment when JFK was assassinated. If not for her choice in headwear, she would probably be a footnote of history. However, given that the assassination took place at the height of the Cold War, her identity has elicited wild theories over the years. While a woman named Beverly Oliver claimed to be the babushka lady, her identity has never been definitively confirmed. There were many theories about who she might have been. Some said she was a Russian spy. Others said she worked for the US government. Some even said that she could have been the murderer and that the camera she was using was actually a gun. Tommy Wiseau. Arguably the most public person on our list, Tommy Wiseau famously wrote, directed, produced, and starred in the unmitigated cinematic disaster that is The Room. You're just a chicken. Chip, 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 chip. Trey, uh, shut up. It's over. Trey, shut up. It's cool. It's shut over. up. It's over. It's not over. Everybody betrayed me. I fed up with this world. Yet, despite having a cult following to go along with his So Bad It's Good film, Wizzo remains just as big a question mark as his acting choices. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Wizzo's background is surprisingly murky, with his country of origin currently unknown, though according to him, he's from Europe. Equally mysterious is where he got the surprising amount of money he sank into making and advertising the room, which cost at least $6 million. Some believe he got it from drug sales or through a mob connection. Honestly, if you told us the guy was an alien, we wouldn't be surprised. Let's put a smile on this face. Why? So serious! Carl Kircher. One little discussed part of history is the fact that a Soviet spy managed to infiltrate the CIA. Spying for the Czechoslovakian intelligence service, which meant spying for the KGB and the Russians because it was a direct line. It went through Czechoslovakia, but his real masters were back in Moscow. Czech-born Karl Kircher managed to get a job in the CIA. Because of his work in the agency and through the reportedly wild swingers parties he and his wife attended, Kircher obtained intelligence that he passed to the USSR. They, uh, they came, they embedded themselves in American society and they uh, proceeded to wreck some devastation. Though some speculate he was in fact a triple agent. Although Kircher and his wife were eventually detained, their case was mishandled and a proper conviction could not be obtained. Eventually, they were let go in a prisoner exchange. Kircher's life after his release has remained private and his true loyalties remain a mystery. Tank Man. The Tiananmen Square massacre is one of the most infamous responses to protest in the 20th century. The event has been immortalized in famous photos and videos of the Tank Man, an unidentified man carrying grocery bags who stood in front of a line of tanks. It was probably just an ordinary person who was so disgusted at what he had seen for the last few days. Video shows him repeatedly standing in front of the tanks, even climbing on top of one and seemingly speaking to someone inside. The man was later pulled away by unidentified people. Tank Man's true identity has remained unknown, though some names have been put forth. For as much as Tank Man remains a mystery to the world, he's even more elusive within China, where references to the Tiananmen Square massacre are censored online. One way the, the Chinese government has managed to control the dialogue and, and the discussion of the past is by controlling the media and publishing, and that it's done quite effectively. Satoshi Nakamoto. Digital currency has many mysteries. 
First and foremost for the average person is probably how it works. But one of its biggest mysteries is the identity of the creator of Bitcoin and blockchain, Satoshi Nakamoto. Generally believed to be a pseudonym for the person or persons who developed Bitcoin, Nakamoto was active online for Bitcoin's first few years, but disappeared in the early 2010s, taking billions worth of the currency with them. Well, there are two competing theories. There's the good Satoshi hypothesis, which holds that Satoshi really wanted to let Bitcoin go and become its own thing without him. The other hypothesis is that Satoshi really just saw Bitcoin taking off and wanted to keep his privacy. In the years since, theories about who Nakamoto really is have included everyone from a systems engineer named Dorian Nakamoto to Elon Musk. I have nothing to do with Bitcoin. I just believe that somebody put that fictitious name in. Nakamoto's identity feels solvable, which is why the continuing mystery remains tantalizing. D.B. Cooper. 36 passengers got off the jetliner in Seattle last night, left aboard four crew members and the hijacker. In 1971, a man using the alias Dan Cooper hijacked a 727 aircraft and managed to extort money worth around $1.3 million in today's currency by threatening to blow up the plane. Here was a man who developed a cult-like following over the years, despite the fact that nobody really knew anything about the guy at all. After the plane landed, refueled, and took off again sans passengers, Cooper parachuted out to an uncertain fate. After actively investigating the case for 45 years and with dozens of suspects, the FBI's current position is that Cooper perished in the jump. Conspiracies and theories by amateurs have persisted, and Cooper's daring bit of air piracy has remained a fixture of pop culture. I think DB is like the coolest guy in America. He did the ultimate crime. The Zodiac Killer. One of the most famous unsolved murder cases involves the serial killer known as the Zodiac Killer. With five confirmed victims, and as many as 37 total, the Zodiac Killer terrorized the San Francisco Bay Area with a series of cryptic letters accompanying his crimes. What is that at the bottom? Leftovers. Maybe an anagram? These letters contained ciphers and cryptograms, some of which remain unbroken today. Many gumshoes, both professional and amateur, have put forth possibilities for the killer's identity, but the case remains open and is considered unsolved to this day. Well, this latest theory comes less than a year after one of the Zodiac's mysterious ciphers was solved. And as long as it remains a mystery, the Zodiac Killer will stay an object of fascination. Yeah, get this. They think that he was a man living in Tuolumne County the whole time who died just three years ago. Banksy. In the art world, Banksy is one of the most elusive figures. He kind of exploded into the stratosphere. All of a sudden, everyone wanted to talk about Banksy, 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 Banksy. Banksy! 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 Banksy. I've heard about this guy for years. An England-based and allegedly male graffiti artist, Banksy's pieces tend to focus on political or social commentary with a distinctive stencil technique. He has a great instinct for pushing buttons. He's distinguished himself from other street artists by having a bigger agenda. Due to the illegal nature of his primary choice of medium, Banksy has been understandably cagey in keeping his identity a secret. While a few popular names have been put forward, Banksy's identity remains as mystifying as his art. I always avoided cameras because what I do is in um, a bit of a legal gray area, but... As a contemporary figure, we feel like it's only a matter of time before Banksy's identity is more than just writing on the wall. Perseus. Spies are mysterious by design. One of the most mysterious may not have even been real. Perseus is the code name of a purported Soviet spy embedded in the Manhattan Project, which developed the atomic bomb. With ruthless efficiency, it allowed him to find out all the nuclear discoveries made by the Manhattan Project. Perseus was supposedly instrumental in the development of the Soviet nuclear program. Some believe that Perseus may have been the name for a group of spies, or even a complete fabrication. While there are several confirmed Soviet spies from the project, none of them have been confirmed to be Perseus. 
сходи, посмотри вокруг дома, что там делается. Я приходил и говорил, вот там за углом стоит машина, в которой сидят двое мужчин или что-нибудь такое. Вот это было. We can only speculate on whether Perseus will remain as mythical as their mythological namesake. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Jack the Ripper Of all the serial killers throughout history, Jack the Ripper is perhaps the most infamous. The Ripper stalked Victorian London's East End, particularly the Whitechapel district, brutally killing at least five sex workers. So obviously to have such a high level of crime, so many murders in literally a few weeks, it really did cause a huge widespread panic. Numerous letters were sent to the police and newspapers, which helped stir up a worldwide media sensation that has endured for over a century. The case remains unsolved. Despite hundreds of suspects being put forward, some as recently as the last few years, there's nothing more frightening than the unknown, and Jack the Ripper will continue to terrify for years to come. But the fact is that, that it did penetrate the consciousness of the people in a way that an ordinary murderer hadn't done in the, in the past and would never do again. Do you agree with our picks? Check out this other recent clip from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.